Right now, the world's best athletes are in Tokyo for the Olympics. But back here in the Central Valley, it's young swimmers that are taking the spotlight. CBS 47's Natalie Vera has more on the Junior Olympics. Nearly 700 swimmers from Bakersfield to Merced are here in Clovis for a four-day meet, showing off their skills, and who knows, we might be witnessing the future Michael Phelps. Those young kids, they're swimming super fast. Go! Go! The kids are here swimming, and the Olympics start today, and so they're feeling the joy of all of that. Joy is clearly in the air and in the water at Clovis North High, where 34 teams from all across Central California are competing at the Junior Olympics. It's an inspirational experience for young kids to get started in competitive swimming. The four-day meet kicked off Thursday, welcoming 690 swimmers after a year of closed pools and virtual trainings. We were doing dry land exercises via Zoom. So many kids in our club, they would go to Millerton Lake and swim. I saw kids that were almost on the verge of depression and just absolutely turn around with their attitude and their look on life when they finally were able to get back in the pool. Let me grab this. Get back in the pool they did. I trained five days a week for two hours. Because every good swimmer knows every millisecond counts. It's a very exacting sport. You can't go home and say, well, I did pretty good because your time's either 30.5 or 31.5. If you tuned into the Olympic trials, you know that there were races that were won by one hundredths of seconds. But every athlete knows winning isn't always everything. It just doesn't matter what place you get. All that matters is you're having fun. A good, healthy competition. I think that's so important for kids. And that competitive spirit may just get them to the major leagues down the line. Every Olympian that's in Tokyo right now started doing this kind of thing when they were young swimmers. There are kids swimming here that are Olympic futures, for sure. The competition ends this Sunday night. Reporting in Clovis, Natalie Vera, back to you.